Namaste. It has been less than a month since Modi ji came back to power. Out of the few initiatives which he took, one thing which came to my notice was that he set a very empowering vision for the next five years for India to make India a five trillion dollar economy by 2024. How it will happen, what needs to be done, that is his side of work. But I feel as entrepreneurs, as leaders, he has set a very powerful example that as leaders, the first and foremost thing which we need to do is to set a very empowering, very inspiring vision for our companies, for our organizations. And that's what many entrepreneurs fail to do. They just start their business, they go on running their business, and they have no idea about what, where to reach, what to do, what to achieve. I will give you a simple analogy. Maybe it's, it's quite simple, but it's, it's humorous also. Have you ever traveled by train without knowing where the train is going? That you went to the station, you, you took a ticket, and you just hopped onto any train which was there at the platform. Have you ever done that? Except Shahid Kapoor and Javvi met. I'm sure nobody else has done that. You would not do that because even if it's a travel for one hour, if it's travel for two hours, you would feel it's a waste of time not knowing where to go. So isn't it the same with your organization? You hop into your train every morning. You hop into your train every week, every month. Have you asked yourself where this train is going? You're the driver of the train and you're driving your train every morning and you're taking your train somewhere and you don't know where it's going. So that's one problem. Second problem is the train has got many passengers. And you passengers not know where the train is going. So what do you say passengers? So if your team is not asking you, where is the train going? Then this is also a problem. And sometimes someone asks a passenger. Sometimes someone asks a team member. Sir, what is the vision of this next year? Sir, where is the train going? And those very people, we don't like. Am I right? We think that it's good. It's becoming more than us. We're asking questions. We've never asked ourselves. We've never asked ourselves where we're going. And we're asking ourselves where we're going. This is the train going. Let's get out of it. And that's how we lose some great guys. And that's how we lose some And that's how we lose some great guys. And in some companies, this complication goes to another level where uh, there are a couple of partners. So imagine that he has come in the morning, that partner, and he takes the train. He starts the engine, he takes the train in the morning. And he takes to a particular destination. He comes to the other partner, he sits on the engine, and he goes back and sits on the train in the morning. And both have worked hard, both have slogged. But the train has not moved anywhere. So when there are two partners or three partners, they don't have a vision. They all will work in an area, in a way, which they feel is right. And the train will never move anywhere. So, Modi ji has set a very powerful example for all of us. Can we set a very powerful vision for our organizations? Not only it is inspiring for us, but it's inspiring for our team members. It's inspiring for our vendors. It's inspiring for our customers to know that they are dealing, they are connecting, they are transacting with a visionary organization. Do take time out to set a very empowering vision. Bye for now. Namaste.